Well, the season of giving may be coming to an end, but local shelters say the need doesn't end with the holidays. Our Zach Labe is live from St. Vincent de Paul with details on how you can help. Zach, good morning. Hey, good morning, Courtney. Yeah, that's right. Giving doesn't have to stop as soon as it hits midnight on New Year's. And with me, I have Michael Caldo with St. Vincent de Paul. So earlier we talked about how people can give and also that special tax break that I didn't know about. And definitely good information. We have a story on our website. You can find more information about that. But for people who want to volunteer their time, how can they do that? Easy to do. Go to svdpbr.org, and there are volunteer opportunities there, everything from helping us with our brown bag suppers to cooking a meal for the homeless guests that we serve. And uh, there are just ample opportunities to give of your time and talent. You know, certainly financial contributions are always welcome. But when you give of your time and your talent, you're doing something very special, something only you can do. And uh, so we encourage people to give of that. And also think about the fact that, you know, 2022, there are going to be a lot of challenges. We know COVID will be with us the first several weeks of 2022. And so we need people to think about how they can give for the whole year because Christmas was a great celebration. Your station was here covering the event. But every day can be a day of giving and caring for people in need. Absolutely. I'm sure it's got to feel great putting a face to the people that you're helping. No doubt about it. I, you know, it's really amazing to see the volunteers. Like on Christmas Day, they came in. They were able to connect with the people that we are very blessed and fortunate to serve. And they heard the appreciation. Now, not everybody is appreciative, but 95% of the people that we shelter, feed, and do things, they are so grateful. They know that they only come to us when they need help, um, and they know we're here for them and that we really care. And that's what volunteerism is all about. Definitely. And so for anyone who's wanting to volunteer, uh, you know, it's giving up your time. So about how much time were people uh, giving? Uh, well, you know, for Christmas Day, we have people give several hours. But you don't have to give several hours. You can give one hour. You can give a day. You can go over to our St. Vincent de Paul Community Pharmacy and volunteer your time answering the phone. You can be here at the dining room and help us do brown bag suppers or even fill plates of food to go for people who are truly in need. Or at the Bishop High Shelter, come help us sort out all the wonderful items that have been donated in the course of the holiday season so that we are prepared to serve those who are truly in need. Definitely. So you can really make uh, giving your time uh, fit your schedule and just uh, really make a good impact on people's lives. Well, thank you so much for being with us this morning. Uh, if you want any more information, we have a story on our website with links available to sign up to volunteer or information on how to donate. But for now, sending it back to you, Courtney.